Hello, Willow Davis, how's it going? Happy uh, Wildo Wednesday, everybody. What does Wildo Wednesday mean? I'm still not quite sure. What does it mean to you? L let me know. I don't I don't know. But anyway, uh, I don't know what Wildo Wednesday means yet, but I do have uh, a highly requested video that we're making here today, and that is another King Cobra JFS reaction. Uh, that that video did better than I thought it would, so I uh, wanted to uh, check out some more of his cooking concoctions today. You know, I found this soda the other day. CNC cotton candy. This is not like a usual thing you find around here. Let me know, is like, is CNC a brand that you can find commonly where you are? Because th th I've only seen this one place before. And it's, it's not, it's, uh, it wasn't that good in my opinion. It's like this blue, and it's not even diet to be honest with you, so that already knocks off some points there, but yeah, I, I didn't I didn't find it very good. What's your least favorite soda flavor? That'll be the question of the day. You tell me, what's your least favorite? Hello, Holly wanted to be in today's video as well. Okay, thank you. Okay, first video here is uh, brought to us by Bite Size Cobra Vids, who I've learned is not associated directly with uh, King Cobra, and also uh, he is apparently not so fond of them, which is quite interesting. Uh, but anyway, I <laughs> I appreciate the, the cutting it down into little Bite Size Cobra Vids uh, to actually, uh, you know, Cut some of the slack involved. What's going on YouTube? I'm making some pasta. I got that brand Cheesy right there, pasta. And then I got this brand right here. What? I didn't even see I what a... That. Kaylee's Kitchen. Beef pasta. Be pasta and beef flavored sauce. That dinner mix. Right there. And, then I got and this brand. pasta and, and right cheesy. Here, and that's all I got to see of that. Of pasta empty into the pot. Here's our seasoning mixes. Um, I got the okay. water turned up to... Uh, well, the heat, I should say, turned up to seven. And I'm gonna get these noodles cooked up real good. Did you put the flavoring on? Is that, you're supposed to put the flavoring in when you cook noodles? I don't know. I don't know, I've never seen it before. Either either you put the mix in already, or that is some scary water right there. I'm not sure which. Eggs out of it uh, <laughs> yesterday, but it's fine. I'm the one eating it, so I'm not sure. Uh, Wait, what do you say? It's a little dirty because I boiled eggs out of it uh, yesterday. It's a little dirty because I boiled eggs out of it yesterday. Oh, is that not seasoning? Is that just the, the residue from the pot? What? Yeah, it's fine. I'm the one eating it, so I'm not tripping out about it. But oh, um, that's fair enough. That's fair. Yeah, fair we're going to uh, boil up these noodles real quick. What? Okay, so the film on the top is not at all associated with the pasta or like the sauce that is currently being made I'm going to, uh, got it drain all the water and... but we're going to let these noodles cook for a bit and uh <laughs> yeah um it should not yeah. take long for these uh pasta noodles to cook up uh, once the water gets to a certain level that's when i'll add a little bit of mustard a little bit of ranch and a little bit of mayo mustard ranch and mayo going into the pasta very interesting i thought it came with it his own sauce but uh i see you're just gonna spice just it to up give it some consistency and stir it up real good and Some consistency. then when it's nice and creamy with the sauce then i'm going to mix in the uh those two cheese powders that came with those boxes oh right there so if you don't have hamburger for those two recipes don't worry about it you know it's still basically something to eat you know what i'm saying Shit. Okay, what? <laughs> See the steam starting to rise. Basically, here, we'll speed things up. Turn it on. The also, I usually, I don't know about you, I usually put the pasta in once it starts boiling, but High for I don't think it's going to really change the uh, outcome here. <laughs> Just to the water starts to I think the end result's going to be some form of slop anyway. Oh, boil. I know y'all <laughs> like my cooking video, so why not, right? And while that's boiling, why not? go over to... Uh, uh, what what's what is what's the idea behind the angle here my youtube here i'm gonna upload another the the sideways close-up here video Let's see you uploading a new video why why is it getting oh, closer is that well we turn <laughs> over here to oh yeah look at that it's starting to bubble up why is it yeah, upside down you know it's upside down we'll let the 
that water boil for a little bit longer and then we're going to add all our sauces what? to it <laughs> and you, you want to add your sauce now it's still sideways add the powder who is this video for sauce when it mixes with the water will liquefy but then as the water boils down i guess if i was watching it on my phone i could just kind of just keep turning it around as it goes it'll congeal yeah congeal that's a great like word mustard, then it right like I'm almost out of I'm almost out of mustard, and I'm like, well, I gotta find a way to just get rid of it here. Okay. Oh. Oh sh. Oh I'll no. I'm gonna bring that down to a four. Don't it's it's Whoa. it's boiling over. It's boiling. There we go. Blow on now it. Now that it's starting to bubble and boil like that, yeah. Bring that back down to a four. Now that it's boiling and. Sh Right, right. I got it. I got gotcha. you. Okay, that's the rest of my mustard right there. <laughs> and um, take all that mustard that I just poured in there, stir it around. And there isn't a whole lot of mustard in there. It's probably, gonna be a, it's probably just, just going to be enough for a little bit of flavor. Okay, yeah. I got you. A little, a little mustard flavor in your Let's pasta. Add some ranch to it. The ranch. This is going to be quite opaque water. I'm wondering if he's going to drain this after, or if it's just going to be like a big soup. What do you think? That's okay. Oh, thank you. That's that's plenty. That's plenty. Yeah, it looks a little funky when you're mixing it up and what have you. But I'm so curious. Do you think he's gonna drain but, it? Um, it'll taste good. Yes, it's well. Yes, it's well. <laughs> it's already starting to get pretty thick. Yeah, buddy. And now we're gonna throw in some of that. Yeah, mayo. buddy. Looking good. That's what's up. Then, all right, so now I want to put the ranch. Actually, we might add just a little bit more ranch to it. Actually, you know what? No, that's enough ranch. Yeah, you don't want to. You don't want to overpower it with the ranch. Am I right? Some of this craft mayo. A little mayo. All over the stove, aren't I? A little extra bit of mayo in there. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Might as well at this point. Now the combination of okay, that ranch right. and that mayo. Cooking with Jack could never. Big heaping spoonfuls of mayo? Nah. Multiple heaping forkfuls. It's gonna give this. That's how King Cobra does really it. Really nice creamy. It's gonna give my noodles, <laughs> my noodles a nice creamy Man, texture. Putting it with a fork. Mm. Oh, thank you. But yeah, that's enough. Thanks, bite-sized Cobra vids. Mayonnaise. Stir that. Sh up in there. We're gonna incorporate all of that. I hate. Oh, here. you splash! Oh, stir. I hate this. A mess. I hate, now you see, it was funny at first, and now that we actually have to look at it, I'm very upset. Just after adding the ranch and the mayo, you know, what I'm saying it's giving you a really nice thick. Uh, see, see the noodles are starting to cook in that. And those and those condiments. Yeah, don't be afraid to use condiments for your pasta game, YouTube. Okay, noted. Thank you very much. You got a favorite condiment? It's like at this point, it's basically like a hot pasta salad. You know, like 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 a macaroni salad. <laughs> it's like you took the the general ingredients of that and just just made you it like, hot and watery. Like to use on your burgers or your hot dogs. In fact, he should try that. You should just. Just take some pasta salad and just wet There's it. There's a little bit of grease on the stove from when I was cooking burgers earlier, like a couple days ago. But that's all right. Or years Stoves up. are meant to get messy, <laughs> I suppose. They clean up after all. That's true. So we're going to let that cook for a bit longer before we add the powder mixes to it. Okay. Let, let it reduce a little bit or what? Oh, no, the sink. No. Oh, well, the look sink. At that, YouTube. Oh. Look at that. You see it? Oh, Starting to congeal. Oh, how does this smell? Congeal again. Oh, YouTube. This smells really good. I like getting referred to as YouTube. I'm liking this. I need a little bit of seasoning. And then the seasoning is just going to be... I, th I thought the seasoning was going to be more mayo. A bit of salt and sugar. <laughs> I thought he was going for the mayo again. Well, salt and sugar? That. Salt and sugar? Because we don't want to we don't want to make our pasta too cholesterol-y. Eh, a little bit of seasoning won't hurt. So we got a Ziploc bag with salt and sugar in it. So what I used to see <laughs> It's a Ziploc bag of salt and sugar? This is my beef. I'm seasoning your frozen patties with a little bit of salt and a little bit of sugar. It's pretty good, actually. Yeah. <laughs> he has a bag ready to go of salt and sugar mixed together for seasoning burgers? <laughs> Maybe a little bit of pepper, too, if you're feeling adventurous. That's such a weird combo of things. It's like... I <laughs> 
You might as well throw like a uh, some <laughs> throw some like lard into that as well. Just like the absolute sinister trio: <laughs> salt, sugar, and fat. I think that's good enough. <laughs> oh my god. That's enough salt and pepper. I mean, did I say salt and pepper? Blah. Salt and sugar. There we go. That's enough, that's enough salt and sugar. <laughs> and so, you know, giving it a minute to cook like this. Why sugar of all things? This, you can see the ranch, the mustard, and the mayo have congealed quite nicely. Let that cook for just a bit longer. And then we're going to add our seasoning packets. It's still upside that's down. Cheesy. It's still sideways, upside down, everything but Toss upright. Right there. That orange stuff, and then right the cheese powder. And this is gonna be what looks like a, a beef flavored sauce. So we got a cheesy beef flavored sauce combination going here. Okay. Bubble, bubble, toil and trouble. Oh. Like a cauldron's bubbles. <laughs> I love Halloween. Yes. Yes. I could have guessed. Pure, pure I could have guessed. Stir it up real good here. And it's starting to congeal together a little bit. That's the congeal, good. the congeal again. That's what, okay. You see how it's starting to bubble really good. I see and it. The noodles are starting to serve. It's looking like a potato soup or something. Yes. Okay. Now would be an excellent time to add. Looking like a chowder. Add the um the powders. <laughs> Powder mixes are in there. <laughs> now what we're going to do. Is take those pasta powder. Why do you film the whole video sideways? And really stir them up in here. This is so chaotic. Stir up the pasta in a circle. Stir it to the left. Stir it to the left. And I'm. You <laughs> this is this is horrible to say. If you didn't know what it was, doesn't that like not look bad? You're like, oh, we're, we're having corn chowder or something. Like, <laughs> it's like. <laughs> Oh god, that's horrible. It's it's I'm I'm disgusted that for like if I, obviously the combination of things is horrible, but like if you just look at it, you're like, oh some oh like we're having some what is that, some some broccoli cheddar soup? Sounds delicious. Fortunately, if you don't have like milk or something, you're gonna get these little ch um cheesy chunks of powder that congeal together. Oh um, boy. Do what you can to like break those up. I mean, I'm not a five-star chef, but I can cook. <laughs> I can throw something together and make something out of it, you know? Same. And nine times out of ten... Same here, man. Nine times out of ten, you know, I'll make something that's pretty good. I've only had, like, one or two meals that I made myself where I'm like, ugh, you know? <laughs> hmm, well, it looks like I might need a bowl. Or a plate or some, some, some shit. You know, I'm just gonna eat it out uh, of the hold pot. Hold on a second, YouTube. I gotta wash a bowl out real quick. Okay, we got a clean bowl here. I feel like he's gonna eat it with a fork. I don't wanna make a bigger mess on the stove. Careful now. See how I did though. It, why is the whole oh, thing yeah, look sideways? Look at that why? steam action. Oh yeah. Whoa. Oh shit balls. I almost dropped you. That would have sucked. <laughs> <laughs> mm, this right here. Oh yeah, this right here is delicious. Oh, I gotta have one more bite. One more bite for the camera. I, I I I can't believe I watched this entire video sideways. Well, I think I did pretty good with this um, random ass dish that I made here. This oh, okay. Well, that's it. There, there's the there's some kind of uh, structure to it. It didn't seem like it well, at first. I think I did pretty good with this. Um, see that again. Random ass. I thought it was just gonna be like. I thought it was just. I thought it was just like a, a porridge or something or some kind of soup. <laughs> it looks like there's some solid material in there. Uh, wow, I can't imagine what that must taste like. All that mayo and mustard and ranch dish that I made here. And well, that's salt and sugar. That's it for my cooking video. Y'all saw how I made that deliciousness right there. Yeah. This is King Cobra JFS with another cooking video. Thank you all for watching. Let me see the comments here. Congealed to perfection. So true. Nothing like boiled mayonnaise. Kay's cooking knows all about that from the uh the oh the <laughs> the the tuna tacos video. I like how adding pepper is the adventurous part. <laughs> well, how wonderful was that? And then we also have uh I'm very <laughs> Very nervous to start this one up. Cooking sushi pizza Doritos nachos. Uh, this is, I, I think, a, a video that was compiled by oh Lennon Lennon Lime. Uh, I'm assuming people <laughs> just kind of take King Cobra's videos and cut them down into little little easier to watch things because I I've looked on his own channel and there seems to be many 
very very long videos i don't i don't know what's up with that like so let me see i'm making uh sushi pizza nachos which what? sounds weird as fuck but that's why you watch this kind of shit, isn't it i you got me there you got me there <laughs> i'm gonna have to turn this up or something i, I don't <laughs> I'm not sure what to do here. Okay, so now that we got the wand drying, let's take a look at this collection that I got so far. Take a look at that. The wand? The, like, oh, sorry. you're making, okay. You're making some colorful wands there. Oh, you're selling them? Oh, very nice. So, I'll have to pick one up. Shout out to the fan who sent those. Oh, you got some Shout ramen. Shout out to uh, Puck Slapper 480. Thank you for the four cases of ramen. Oh, that's what nice. What flavor is it? It's green chili. Green chili. So we're doing a shirt review slash ramen. Green movie. chili. All right. Awesome I kind of wanted to see the uh, the cooking here. Oh, he's cleaning. Oh, wow. Who would have thought? Wow. And now, oh my God, look at that clean people stove. People on YouTube are going to be like, oh, your stove's disgusting. Oh, your pan's disgusting. Nah, 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 nah. I, re I remember, I said that, yeah, I'm I think. I'm the bachelor. I'm the one eating the food. I don't care. You know, maybe I'll take you along for the journey, show you how I make my crazy random food. That becomes a thing on YouTube. Like, what f gross concoction is this motherfucker going to make now? You know, and that's oh, the Okay. Thing of it, YouTube. That's what draws. <laughs> I, okay, uh, I need. I need to see the cooking. Okay, I think he's getting started here. We're gonna make nachos with melted cheese. Oh. Some These are the chips to do it with. People. Dor Doritos nachos. Never would have thought of it. That's a good idea, actually. <laughs> Holly, what's the matter? Are the Doritos upsetting you? Okay. Plating those <laughs> Doritos there. Is there a Philadelphia oh. cream cheese rolls? Oh I man! After it was dethawed. Or... Dethawed. <laughs> dethawed. I love a Philadelphia roll. There's there's a place around here I can get a nice vegan Philadelphia roll. I think it might be my favorite sushi roll. Pizza sauce. So we got Doritos. We got Philadelphia roll. We got tomato this sauce. Is, this jar doesn't want to open up. That jar is looking a little looking rough. Oh. Hashtag arm flex. Uh, there we go. That's Look looking very crusty and a and little dark around the edges, that uh, that jar there. Bison. Get it. Oh, wow. So that's just going right on those Doritos, huh? Are you sure there's no mold in that thing? Also, the towel covering the counter. Oh, my God, this video is so quiet. Okay, so he's putting the sauce on. <laughs> This is quite unwatchable. Okay. Pizza sauce is on point, he says. Okay, what's that now? What? Oh, he's getting more sauce. Do you normally do you normally cook facing away from the camera? Looking nice. Next Okay. Mozzarella cheese. Oh, okay, okay. It looked like a bag of shredded lettuce for a second. I was gonna be like, no. There's no way. There's no way this man's using lettuce. Mozzarella cheese on nachos is dank as <clears throat> because it melts the quickest. Okay, that, that's the, an interesting reason to choose that. Let's see. Okay, so it's it's like a pizza, but instead of a crust, it's just a, a bunch of nacho cheese Doritos. Honestly, uh, I'm I, I'm I'm not horribly opposed to it at this point. I I I, I, I kind of understand the vibe. It's definitely some like stoner food or something, but uh. I'm sure if you could get over the nacho Doritos and the the pizza topping stuff, uh, that it could be it could potentially be good. What is that? Some pepper? <laughs> okay, skipping ahead. This skipping ahead. Oh, he put put more cheese on top of the pepperoni. Right. Good enough for now. Good enough for now. I'm gonna hit that with some seasoning. Okay. A little sprinkle of Tony's. Tony's sprinkle of Tony's. Tony's what? <laughs> What did Tony provide you? <laughs> Who's Tony? Okay, get a little nuke, a little microwave. <coughs> so I'm gonna put it in the microwave for a minute and 34. Minute 34. And um, the Very goal specific. is to get the cheese nice and stringy and melted, but not overcooked and burnt to so, okay but yeah shout out to uh bonsai sushi company it's giving them a shout i'm sure they appreciate the, the shout out uh, final ingredient on the nachos very interesting and uh, the sushi once the teeth on is nice and squishy like sushi supposed to be squishy and like it's supposed to be as you can see it's a little bit empty because i had some earlier <laughs> and it was delicious <laughs> Um, I say snacking on the ingredients the wasabi and the uh, soy sauce for these nachos So I would have done a burger or a pizza, but the items I use to make those things need to be cleaned so. Okay 
How's the nachos looking? I can't see. Good. That's a lot of fucking cheese, man. It's a lot of cheese. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Oh, the corner of the cabinet where he grabs it all the time. <laughs> Why is it? Oh, God. Yeah. I can't see it. Gooey puddle. Oh, boy. A nice gooey puddle. <laughs> he said. I can hardly see it. <laughs> What's this now? Oh, the, okay, the sushi. So yeah, shout out to a Bonsai Sushi Company. I th I'm sure they're loving the recognition. Why not just have it separate? That looks good. Like, okay, the sauce and the cheese on the chips, I get it, but like, the, why not just have the sushi on the side? Are you gonna be like scooping up a piece of the sushi with the chip? Is that the soy sauce? Just, oh no, oh no. Oh, that's a lot of wasabi. Yikes. I guess some of it's, it's not that bad. Folks distributed I don't know, some of them it looks like a lot <coughs> yeah mm. that wasabi is a spicy motherfucker. i bet it is it's got everything I like. we getting a taste test or no like, it's got pizza ingredients it's got doritos and it's got sushi and it's got wasabi true and soy sauce i mean it's like a combo meal in one this is as weird as it gets youtube look at that <laughs> get it <laughs> I don't know. I think the last one was a little weirder. Oh, this is good. Oh my f***ing god. This is gonna be quite the taste test. Like I needed a cooking video that I, that I could do legitly. Right. Okay. My mouth is watering just looking at this. Give it a try. Give it a try. I'd love to hear a review. I also have a uh, spare keyboard that you see sitting in the chair over there. Uh, are we trying the food or? <laughs> help towards my next album. Ooh. For your next album, I I'll have to give it a listen. I'll I, I must right. That is a quality looking keyboard right there. Something to wash them nachos down. We got. Oh, no. oh man, I was just talking about that the other day. It's the Mountain Dew made with uh, real sugar instead of high fructose corn syrup. I want to try that. I haven't seen it in a long time. Well, I don't know when this video was made, but uh, yeah, the the sodies with the real sugar way better than the corn syrup. But you know, I'm a diet sodi fan, of course. Okay. Now, the reason I say this is because I was watching a video that someone took off my channel. Oh. They basically edited out a bunch of shit to make it short. Right. He's talking about these channels now, okay. God damn it! <laughs> okay. Massive. The food review. The food review. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's, I see. He's stacked up the uh, sushi, the slice of the sushi roll. Maybe there's some wasabi on top. Well, <laughs> struggling with it. Spicy? Good? What's wrong? He looks upset. <laughs> That's, That's what's up? Happen. That's what's up or what? I, think I just about had a mouth orgasm there. Oh my. This is the kind of <laughs> okay. <Yeah. laughs> okay, I'm not gonna watch meat the whole thing. YouTube, look at it. I clean the plate. Legit. Very nice. Very nice. Very proud. All right, let me see. The primordial ooze encrusted on that old sauce jar needs to be studied by NASA. <laughs> I knew I was on to something with that. Those filthy cupboard edges, yeah. Well, I don't know, there you go. What, what'd you think? Uh, you, are you uh, upset that I decided to uh, check out King Cobra again? Should I should I have just left it alone? <laughs> did you did you enjoy this? But either way, uh, thanks for watching. I think, what, so today's Wednesday. Tomorrow, uh, probably 7 p.m. Eastern time again, I'm gonna be going live on YouTube again like I did last week. That was a fun time. I think we could try to make that like a regular thing. So you should stop by if you're uh, catching this early enough. And of course, I'll be streaming on Twitch later today as well. You should come by twitch.tv slash Willow Davis. And other than that, I'll see you next time. Willow Davis, out.